Good morning, Mr. O'Donnell. Could you please tell me your name and then spell your last name? Good morning. It's John G. O'Donnell, O apostrophe, capital D, O N N E L L. Approximately how many times have you had your deposition taken? I've had my deposition taken well over 200 times. Are you comfortable with dispensing with the typical admonitions given in a deposition? Yes, I'm very familiar with those admonitions and comfortable with dispensing of them. What is your understanding of the scope of your designation in this matter? The scope of my designation is to uh, assess the civil and environmental engineering aspects of the grading and drainage involved in this case. What task have you performed in uh, your analysis? Uh, part of my tasks were to uh, go out and gather documents from the depository, review those documents related to our client and the uh, clients surrounding our clients. So our client did the grading and drainage, the surrounding clients uh, uh, built the retaining walls, the found building foundations and the concrete flat work. So all of those allegations, defect allegations against our client include not only the grading and drainage, but the uh, re cracks in the retaining walls, the, uh, the cracks in the foundations, the settling of the, uh, and cracking of the uh, concrete and the etching of the concrete. And regarding the grading and drainage, it would be the uh, negative drainage towards the uh, foundations and the uh, ponding in within the yards themselves. So I went out and uh, looked at those depository documents, and then I, I performed a site inspection with photographs and detailed measurements. Uh, we took the uh, concrete samples and we sampled the uh, corings uh, with the petrographic analysis to determine what were the quality of the concrete. We went out and took uh, uh, borings of the soil to determine the uh, content of the soil, whether it was heavy in clay, et cetera, and whether some of those issues might have caused problems with the uh, uh, infrastructure and uh, facilities within the case. Have you produced a report of your opinions in this matter? Yes, I have. Can you give me a brief overview of what your opinions are going to be? Yes, my report includes uh, uh, the conclusion, my analysis, uh, my uh, cost of repairs, and in the conclusion I've determined that our client fell within a reasonable standard of care and that the uh, defects that are alleged are either uh, within uh, non-defect uh, category where they're aesthetic or if there are problems that there are problems that may have been created by other situations or other parties. Are you going to be providing any methodology of repair for any defects that you believe do exist? Uh, yes, we have. And are you going to be providing any cost as to the uh, repairs that you're asking for? Uh, yes, we do as well. How many times have you testified in trial? Uh, somewhere between uh, 10 and 20 times. Have you ever been disqualified as an expert in court? No, I have not. 